The Gold Coast Bulletin reported that Marcus Bai and the Brotons formally worked together on the PNG NRL license bid team, but Bai quit in 2009, fearing millions in government funding was being wasted on a fruitless bid. Earlier this year, Bai publicly called for the PNG government to launch an inquiry into allegations the PNG bid consortium, led by the Brotons, squandered almost 8 million kina of 20 million kina in government money in an attempt to clinch the next NRL license. The Brotons quit in 2010 and the PNG bid team is being led by former Roosters and Cowboys player Brad Tassel. Mr. and Mrs. Broughton are suing by for $250,000 and 240000 in damages, claiming his comments cost them lucrative business deals and damaged their reputations. Last night, Bai, the former Gold Coast winger who won a premiership with Melbourne, said he was surprised the Brotons were suing, but he would take it up with his lawyers. In court documents filed on September the 27th, Mr. Broughton, 82, said Bai's comments had led to his sudden retirement in March from his $4,166 a month position as honorary chairman for his beloved Titans. However, he told the media at the time he was retiring due to the club's financial problems. Mr. Broughton claims he lost $87,500 as a result of ending the contract which was due to end in December 2013. The claim also states Bayes' comments cost Mr. Broughton an $18,000 contract with the Central Queensland NRL license bid team and a 60000 sale contract for the joint travel agency NITO Australia trading as Events Travel, the official travel agent for the Titans. The documents filed by Hickey lawyers claim the comments have made the Broughton's business opportunities in PNG untenable and they no longer feel safe to travel here.